These are some of the coils. There's going to be a total of 36 coils in the motor. Here's nine of them. Black sand cores, black sand surface on the ends. Here's a rotor. There's going to be three rotors in it. There's magnets. Eight magnets all around. One and a quarter inch edge to edge spacing. Also the magnets are one and a quarter inch wide. The magnets are half inch thick. Eight magnets all facing north. That's the rotor. Evenly spaced. Here's one of the magnets inside the rotor of the eight magnets. They're neodymium type. It's half inch wide, inch and a quarter wide. They're very strong N42s, N45s strength. And there's eight of these in the rotor. This is uh, the black sand material that goes inside the cores. I mix it with epoxy glue. It's also this black stuff at the surface of the ends of the coils. Here's some black sand stuck to this magnet. It, uh, it's really good material for cores against neodymium magnet rotors because it doesn't stick like iron. It, the magnets will glide past it fairly easily. So there's not much latch and there's random polarities to the uh, Fer ferrous materials inside of here. If you, they stick all, point all different directions, other than like a solid piece of iron would have all north south one way. For example, here's a piece of iron. It sticks really hard to the magnet. But you don't want that. You want easy latch. Okay.